it's a deal that uh, Blues left late to announce last night, as they did with the uh, previous night with uh, the transfer of Christian Bielik. But Ethan Laird is now officially a Birmingham City player. It was a rumour that picked up steam as the uh, day went on. And it seemed to progress from a loan deal to a permanent deal, which is, I think, fantastic business for Birmingham and all parties involved with Manchester United offloading one of the youngsters that perhaps is a fringe player in their setup, but will certainly be a top player in our setup. And we'll slot straight into that right wing back role, replacing the departing Maxim Collin as of today, July the 1st. He leaves and Led comes in. And I just think this is a fantastic deal for the future and a real sign of intent once again from Craig Gardner working in tandem with John Eustace as well as the board. Laird has put pen to paper on a three-year deal and spoke in his uh, interview with the club yesterday about the project at the club. And this is something that, again, is really positive and something that I think would entice a lot of youngsters now to join Birmingham. We look at the sort of um, age group of people that have joined the club already, besides Kevin Long, who's in his 30s. You look at Roberts and Miyoshi and Bielik, who are in their mid-20s, and now Laird, who's in his early 20s. And they're really signing up and uh, subscribing to this project and, uh, yeah, really in for it. And I just think that... Uh, the club is really going to start to move up the table now and progress. And this positivity seems to be spreading all around with the uh, players and the fan base and the coaching staff. It just looks to all be taking shape now and uh, real reasons to be positive once again. With regards to Laird as a player, he has um, already played a handful of championship games. Well, more than 50 in uh, his career so far, playing for uh, Swansea, Bournemouth and most recently QPR, where um, he racked up 33 appearances last season in all competitions, scoring one goal and getting two assists and... Uh, I think in the formation that we're going to play this season, he's going to have the license to get forward a bit more and really uh, express himself. And uh, he seems to bring this vibrancy that he displayed in his interview with the club, where uh, I think he'll slot right in with the environment at the club. And uh, yeah, we'll certainly bring a positivity that seems to be spreading around the whole camp now. And uh, yeah, I just think this is a really positive sign going forward. The fact that we can attract these youngsters from Man United to uh, sign up and play for Birmingham in this uh, project that we seem to be building. And I just think the feel-good factor is really back. And uh, something that I mentioned yesterday in the Bielik video, where I just think, you know, these signings are real sort of done with intent and with a target in mind. And uh, we've made five signings already this season, whereas this point last season we hadn't made any. So I just think there's a real outline of what we're going to do and uh, really positive signs going forward for the future. The reported FIFA led looks to be around £750,000, which I think is an absolute bargain if you look at today's market and some of the... Uh, prices that players are going for if you can get someone from Man United uh, for under a million pounds it's still 21 years of age it's just a phenomenal deal and uh, you see again Craig Gardner and Darren Fletcher linking up with uh, Fletcher being the technical director at Man United and it seems to be that this link is uh, proving good for Birmingham with uh, Chong coming in through this link as well as Hannibal and even Mengi two seasons ago and uh, looks to be this environment building where players know players and uh, played with each other in the past you look at uh, Laird and Roberts played with each other last season at QPR and um, Chong and Hannibal knowing Led from the uh, Man United Academy and uh, yeah, Chong linking up with Led again. It just seems to be a real positive sign going forward and uh, this community of players looks to be now all under the same roof and uh, fighting for the same cause and I just think that Led is someone that the fans are going to love. He's going to give his all and uh, yeah, hopefully a couple goals as well from this wing-back role that he can uh, get forward a bit more and uh, deliver some goals. Please let us know in the comments below which players we should look to sign and uh, which positions we should look to strengthen now because I think this uh, right wing-back role is ticked off of Laird and uh, yeah, possibly a striker and a couple of centre-backs to come in. We'll see. But uh, yeah, like, comment, subscribe and most importantly, keep right on.